Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amir. Today we are going to learn uh, how to create uh, a parameter where we can uh, use the wildcard search. Uh, so let me take you to the query and here is my query. So we have a select statement and uh, we are uh, selecting the records from a total sale table. And if I want to introduce something like that uh, where uh, sales person first name uh, like uh, uh, and we can search on uh, let's say LLE and uh, we say okay anything that has the uh, L E E so that's what we want to search here uh, so this is a uh, Alina is a return uh, we want the same kind of uh, capability in the report uh, we want to have this one as a parameter and uh, there any anything that will be enter we want the matching record uh, there so let's take the same query and uh, we are gonna use in the reporting uh, so uh, let let me take this query go to the SSDT SQL Server data tools we have the shared data set uh, source so we don't need to create one if you don't have it you ha can go ahead and create one and uh, then we go to reports and say add and a new item here a empty report will be created we are gonna call this one search parameter and uh, you can call this one whatever you like add now empty report is uh, created once you have the empty report, uh, the very first thing you need to do is uh, create a data source or point to the existing uh, one. So here you can create an embedded one uh, that will be specific uh, or uh, local uh, to the report and uh, we can use the shared one uh, in our case. Uh, so that can the shared one can be used for multiple reports. Uh, so we use that data source. Uh, let's rename this one. We call it DS sales. Now let's go to the data set uh, and say add data set and uh, let's call this one the set uh, sale total now this is going to be embedded in the report okay so ds sales is our data source and this is our query to create a search parameter you have to do something like that you will be saying where and uh, in our case we want to sell person last name and first name so we want to use this one as a, a parameter we will be saying where like and then you have to have single quote here and then put percentage single quote again and plus sign and then use your parameter name so in, in my case I'm going to say uh, first name you can name anything uh, this is going to be used for your uh, sale person first name so you can name uh, anything uh, when it comes to the parameter it doesn't have to be exactly the field name what you're using here so the same thing we have to add on the other side so we do plus sign single quote the, and the percentage sign and single quote so if you see here you can have only on one side if you are uh, looking for okay I want to do searches where uh, I want I can have anything on the left side and uh, I, whatever the value I provide on the left side and then uh, I don't care about the right side I want to have anything so you can use it in my case I'm checking on both sides so left and right so you can change a little bit according to your requirement uh, for me as you guys are telling you you can put anything between uh, these two and this will be exactly working like uh, this so that's why I'm just adding these uh, percentage uh, signs on both sides so that's how I'm doing now we are good hit ok let's go and uh, insert a table and bring the first name last name and product name and region now go to the preview and take a look so here is the first name if I will just put a, a and a and a, try to run query it is a returning me nothing so let me see if I have a, a my database is set to the case sensitive so that's the one reason I, I did not get the results for a small a small a now when I'm putting a a then I will be getting armor so if I will do the same thing what we have done in the query uh, l l e so you can see that it uh, it return us uh, Alina and uh, the same way let's say we have other records uh, let me run this one and show you what else we have uh, we have Sukhjit uh, and if I will JE if I will use that one I will get this uh, result uh, and uh, I can put this entire thing if I want I can put the retub or uh, Petra so whatever we can use uh, here so let's uh, if I will do JEE -E or JE -E simple 
and I will get Sukhjit. If I will do simply J, and let's see, we got two of them. One is Najaf because N A J, so that's where we see J, and here we see J. So that's how you can create a report that can where you can use these search parameter. And sometimes it's important. Let's say you have a comments. Uh, field uh, that has uh, a lot of comments and it's uh, your users want to have a parameter where they can put some value and search the only records related to that uh, search so this is a good idea to create uh, something like that thanks very much for watching this video and i will see you guys in the next video